So this is how to use explain everything. So first we have to open up explain everything. So I'm going to tap on the app. So I'm just going to show you a few things to get you started. So if you want to start from scratch, you're going to hit the plus sign in the upper left hand corner. And then they give you um, some options. Um, you don't, I would just pay attention to the background because you can change the three colors that are shown. So I'll be honest, I will like to start with a black background personally because then the things that you put on pop a lot more than a white background. So just to get us started, um, to type on the left hand side, click on the A and then tap anywhere on the screen that you want to start typing. So I'm going to say this is how to use explain everything. So I personally don't like things off to the left. I want them centered. So what you do is you um, hit the down keyboard in the bottom right. So you see how I still have the green check mark and the blue circle. That means I can still work within this. So if I click on the A on the left hand side, I can um, increase the size. And I can go as big as I want. And yes, you see how some of the letters are disappearing. They're not gone completely. So if I uh, drag that blue circle, there we go. So it's still not centered. So the way to do that is go to the finger in the upper left and then tap twice. So it brings up that gray box again. So if I hit centered right now, it's going to center it. All right. Sometimes if it's not working the way you want, if you hold your finger down and as soon as you see that bubble appear, hit select all. And then you can do anything you'd like. I can make it bold, whatever I want. I can also change the um, size of the font. If you notice the little A and, sorry. Uh, in the upper left is undo. We like that. If you see the little A underneath like the E and everything and the big A in between it says the font size so I could change the font size again if I wanted to go smaller. All right, I can change my font. So right now I have Arial MT. I could change it to any of these. I might go to Hebrew. Okay, I can give borders if I'd like, all these different options. So I'm happy with what I have right now. So let's hit the down keyboard in the bottom, right? So I don't want my font to be white. So everybody see how the colors white, pink, and light blue are in the bottom left. So white is highlighted right now because that's what color the font is. And notice I still have the green check mark and the blue circle. So if I hold my finger down on that white box with the check mark, a box pops up. I can choose one of the colors it shows or I can actually put my finger on that black circle in the color wheel and I can find the color that I want. So I might go with like a blue green. Okay. So once I'm happy with it, you can see it's already changed my font color. So once I'm happy with it, I can click anywhere on the screen. And if I'm done with the font, I can click anywhere on the screen and it gets rid of it. And notice it goes back to the finger, the pointer. If in doubt, go to the pointer finger. That's my one big hint.